Moon rising and Venus for Pisces. Knight of Pentacles towards Capricorn Virgo is here. <laughs> and then the Queen of Wands jumped out. Seven of Swords and traveling here is reversing the towel moment. But okay. So you have the Knight of Pentacles. Uh, Pisces. Hold on, Pisces. I just feel like. There we are. Okay. Someone is moving slow towards you. What else for Pisces? And we will do the partner next. And um, what don't you see coming next as well. That's the Taurus. The sun is out. Beautiful commitment. You do have the eight of swords reversed. Which I do like for Pisces reversed. I'm going to read slow and steady here. Uh, just like this reading. I'm moving a little. My pace is different. Not to rush things. Right, let's see. Coming out of this mental entrapment here. Eight of Swords. Pisces. You might be starting a new gym routine. Working out. Hermit. Virgo energy. Ooh, Pisces. You have a Virgo. And the other tarot deck, which I will pull to clarify is this deck. It came with soul searching. And um, the Hermit to me comes with wisdom. Alright, so to me, you're speaking to someone who's very wise, who has a lot of wisdom, very mature energy here, Pisces. And um, you and this person could have sparked interest, and this person may have had some trialing, some trying times like you have, and you guys communicate very well. You actually uh, give both of each other uh, a lot of wisdom. And I think that's going to make a connection or a stronger foundation for you and this partner coming towards you, Pisces. But uh, before I start re reading just three cards, let me pull some more. I see the Ace of Wands. Um, I'm glad it came out because I was, I was literally le leaning towards a lot of passion with maybe a Virgo. It could also be a Taurus Capricorn, now Aries El Sag. And um, because you guys share just wisdom, you know, Pisces is also Virgo likes to be um, deep within as well. Um, so this person might have Virgo rising. Like I was kind of looking for that perfect angle with the table. You know, my Virgo is kind of like kicking in like perfectionism. So anyway, outside of just being perfect. You and this person might be perfect for each other because I see a lot of passion there. So let's see what else we got for the Pisces. I also, I just seen the Nine of Pentacles, which is also Virgo. This person likes to work, um, likes to be stable. Let's see, Pisces. Whoa! And the Ten of Swords are in your head and money. Okay, so Three of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Hmm. From passion to, to, to three of swords. Why am I Pisces have this three of swords that came out? But we're going to clarify. This could be a small amount of Pisces going through this three of swords still. Past trauma. Eight of swords. Maybe you're speaking to a therapist. Let's see. Pisces. What's coming towards Pisces? Or what do Pisces need to know? That was powerful. We're going to put it up, right? That's the high priestess. And the devil. Mm, interesting. <laughs> and the judgment is reversed. <sighs> oh my goodness, Pisces. I can't even. I gotta take my shirt off. I'm I'm sweating. Um. And uh, maybe I might. The windows are already open. So. Ooh, it's getting hot in here. A high priestess and the devil. Temptation and toxic energy. And also, it's an energy, Pisces, of silence as well. This is your reading. So, and this is toxic, tempted, temptation. Um, am I picking up Temptation Island? If you guys ever watch this series where you allow your partner to date another woman and see if he truly loves you if another woman is tempted to take him 
that means he never was yours or some type of risk is what I'm seeing. And this is maybe that agony, three of swords. Maybe you were like, okay, my partner loves me. I know he loves me. He's not going to be tempted. Or someone might flirt with your partner around the holidays or try to, you know how some women could be freaking like flirtatious with your partner. Or this could be you. I don't know. Let me, before I clarify and get this, I just see either a ghosting. I do see some pain here and some trauma that needs to be healed. And I see also some Pisces could be using uh, intimacy and power to kind of get what we want, in a sense. Because we just got this kind of, um, we kind of like shutting down maybe. And you're just like what soulmate what love anymore i don't believe in that i don't know i'm getting too deep with this so let's see what else pisces need to know before we go to the partner <laughs> no cards can you guys see me shuffling no cards want to come out what do pisces want me to know ace of pentacles so you do have an offer of love coming here you have two aces conjoining towards each other you know is on top of each other so you do have some New beginnings, this is the past, this is the current and future. But I will pull some bonus cards um, for the Pisces here. So let's get some bonus messages. Something that Pisces don't see coming. Even though I would love to leave it at that new beginning, but I just want to clarify more. What is, because this is the past, present, and future. So what can't we see coming towards us, Spirit? Okay, so you have the four of pentacles, not wanting to let go, or maybe finally letting go with that four of pentacles reversed. What else do Pisces need to know we can't see coming? The chariot, cancer, it kind of, I don't know if it's up, reverse, I, I don't know. Um, so willpower, force, um, so yeah, that is your soulmate that texts you. <laughs> Am I blushing? I can't wait to go live, you guys. I know I've been saying it for so long, but I just haven't had the things that I want to do um, together. So, let's get one more bonus card. And then three of wands. So, someone could be in a distance from you, Pisces. Um, you guys have a mutual attraction to each other. You guys are very spiritual. Um, and you, you guys fall in love easily. So maybe this is what that is. Um, yeah, so I'm, I got to turn my, I don't want to get distracted with the phone. But I think in one of the reading, readings, Pisces, I posted and I deleted the video. But what I'm going to do, if you're listening and watching this video, Go to my second channel. Every video I didn't feel comfortable posting for Pisces, I'm going to post on a second channel. And if it resonates with any of you guys, leave me a comment below. Because I made so many videos and then I was so distracted by text messages or anything else. And I just didn't feel right um, posting it. And I want to make sure I give you guys a perfect, again, that Virgo energy reading. Let me get my glasses of Pisces because I have to read these new cards and I can't see I'm losing my vision as I get older all right so you got the knight of pentacles so you're moving slow towards something um you're moving slow knight of pentacles for my Pisces all you guys can see how fancy shuffling I'm doing here for you guys uh, for like Pisces. I love it when I have brand new cards and the cards just flow right out. Um, so if you guys like to leave me a donation to get me some more cards, I would love that as well. One of these cards, I believe, cost me about $90. It was this deck with the ethnic people. <laughs> okay. Um, so I do want to use this deck. But, um, I think I'm going to use this deck for the partner, even though I shuffled the shit out of this card. But let me see what we got here. First, the top. And then we have the bottom. 
Wheel of Karma. So, all right, Pisces. So we're gonna use that for the part I want to tell you and what Pisces need to know. That's how the readings are gonna go. And when I cut the deck, you got the page of swords in the chariot. Someone could have Googled you, or someone is watching you. Could be a Aquarius, but I'm not or Cancer. Okay, stalker alert. And then you have Ace of Swords, speaking the truth, seeking the truth, whatever. Um, but you move to one Pisces. So if the partner from the past, if it's a Cancer or whoever it is, thinking that they left you bound and mentally um, displaced, you're not. All right. So you're going to unbound yourself. Four of Wands is here. All right. Um, you're not interested in the past at this point. Moving forward, why is the Knight of Pentacles for the beautiful Pisces here? Knight of um, the King of Cups. Okay. And, a pa and a, is that the Five of Swords and the King of Swords? Crazy bitch, Gemini. Um, you're doubting Five of Swords. And you, you're also thinking that people are attacking you. So if you have social media and you're thinking someone is like being negative on your channel, they're not. Or even if they are, who cares? That's just how people are because they're low vibration. You're high at Pisces. So you do have uh, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, as well as Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You might be young, older than this person. This person could be younger than you. Again, if I have disruption in the video, I will pause the camera and re-do what I need to do and re-record. It doesn't mean I'm stopping the reading. Why is the Eight of Swords here reversed? Also, the readings are from 10 minutes to 30 minutes. Same day. Seven of Coins. I like it. You guys are both hardworking. Also, this could speak of um, therapy, yoga, meditation during the winter. You know, doing something that you normally don't do. Something that you, which Pisces always do anyway. But we do a lot of activities alone. This is a, this is speaking to me alone. But then there's three of suits. I got to clarify that very soon. Because that worries me a little bit. Let's just look at it. So you got the full take a leap of faith. Traveling. Um, so if you do travel to someone Pisces, you might, if that, if the place doesn't, if it looks displaced or messy, get out of there. That's not what you're signed up for. Alright. Or you might see something on the holidays that this person character or who they are is not who they are. But this is about Pisces. But let me see. Or someone might say to you Pisces, you're not who I thought you were. Who is the hermit for Pisces? Why is Pisces in um, solitude? The two of coins. So you need time to think and take that time, Pisces. Um, if you do have suitors, ace of wands for the holidays or Thanksgiving, make the right decision. And some of us are alone for the holidays and it's okay. All right. It doesn't mean it's the end of the world, Pisces. Okay. Now, let me see. Ace of wands. Mm -mm, that devil again. Toxic energy. Addiction. Are you getting addicted to someone or something, Pisces? And here's the high priestess. I couldn't have pulled it better. Someone is addicted to you. And then here's the chariot right behind the high priestess and the empress. Three major arcanas right behind each other. That's Taurus, uh, Libra, chariot, cancer, the high priestess of Pisces. Someone is going bananas here. Um, this is this is your reading. So let me see here. Quiet. Are you going crazy from somebody, Pisces? Mm. Did you fall in love? And you can't let go. Or you fell in love, and uh, this person will hurt you or did hurt you. Let's, let me see. Why is the Three of Swords here for Pisces? What's this pain? And it landed on, this, on the Three of Swords. Um, six of Wands. Winning. So. Don't try to be karma, Pisces. Don't play karma. Not, not that you will, but you know. 
I don't know. Some Pisces, you know, some some of them, okay. <laughs> some Pisces, depending on the uh, placement of your, you know, sign. Six of Wands. You want to win someone over. Let me just say it. You might win. You might want to win someone over, even though someone rejected you. Or if things are not working right, you might just deal with it for the holidays because you don't want to be alone. Something you want to get revenge or you want to, you know, you hurt me, I'm going to hurt you, I'm going to take this. That's what I'm getting from this. You hurt me, this is what I'm going to do to you. Like revenge. Why is the high priestess here? Or some of us might just kind of lay in solitude and cry it out. Yeah, look at the ten of swords reversed from my high priestess and the tower. Okay, Ten of Swords. You're trying to dig these swords out of your back. Now, if you're moving towards a new connection, Pisces, which I do see, don't um, hold the new person accountable for the other fuck up. You see what I'm saying? Well, let me not curse because I know if I curse, they're not going to really monetize it. Um... But what, what was I going to say? If someone messed up, I guess it ain't worth saying. I don't know if I got. Y'all leave the comments. What was I saying? <laughs> It'll come back to me. Why is the devil here toxic energy for Pisces? The hermit. That's Virgo. Hmm. Okay, searching, digging. The hermit is also searching and digging like that. Uh, where was the other card with the guy with the computer in here? Is it a page of swords, I think, or five of swords? Yeah, right here, the page of swords. Um, internet searching. Some, some, somebody is searching and looking up someone. Hmm. Temperance and the ten of wow, wow. I didn't even expire. I was just shuffling. And temperance, having patience, and ten of cups came out. Pisces, have patience because something out there is for you, and that's this new beginning. But I do want to clarify. It just came out. Temperance and the ten of cups, happiness. Very beautiful card. Cards with the S at the end. So, what I'm gathering, if someone hurts you, let it go. That's it. Let it go. Some of us are letting it go in solitude. You could have ghosted this person. Um, I, I see an addiction here. or Some type of revenge that Pisces. Uh, let's see. Who's the Ace of Pentacles for Pisces? The Two of Wands waiting in a distance. Go on, go travel, Pisces. I'm thinking about Africa, West Africa, in 2024. I'll let you guys know. Africa, it is for sure. Um, so let me see. Let's clarify your future messages here. You have a new beginning. You have, before we clarify this, I just want to make sure everyone understands this reading. So you have new beginning coming towards you, the two of wands waiting for this new beginning. You do have a new beginning, but something is toxic. Now, if this is not you, Pisces, I could be honing into your partner. It could be a past, current, or um, or new partner. You have happiness here, okay? Um, I just see, for real, seriously, like someone is falling in love. And then something is going to happen and you might get hurt. And someone might seek revenge. But uh, let's see what we got here. It could be you or your partner because nowadays people are not understanding no means no. It's a breakup. People are turning into psychological uh, psychotic. You know, they can't understand that it's a, it's a no. You know, the relationship is over. You know, they want to go to extremes and start doing psychotic behavior. Why is the four of pentacles here? The hangman feeling stuck. 
holding on to your own money, Pisces, because you felt stuck. Right? Here's the High Priestess and the Ace of Wands. That passion, not listening to, to your intuition. All right? Or you were stingy with something, something, but now you're not. You're actually um, unstuck, in, unstuck in yourself. Opening up. All right? Let me see. Three of Wands could be someone in a distance. Why's the Three of Wands after some tragedy? And the Three of Coins came out with hers. This is working together. It's reversed with the Three of Wands. So maybe you're asking someone to pay for your trip, pay, pay for your travels. You're not responsible for it. But again, this could be me honing into the partner and what happened. Or this could be a new partner here as well that's toxic, toxic and becoming obsessed with you. Let's see the chariot for Pisces. Why is this here? Two of swords, something you can't see with the cancer or vehicle. What else for this cancer? The three of cups. Hmm. And then the five of cups. Someone is missing, someone not taking a leap of faith. The empress is here. And then you have the queen of cups and pregnancy here. I don't know why they made the queen of cups. Why, why are we pregnant? Um... Uh, is an age difference with the imprints. <sighs> okay, five of cups. Someone is missing, you know. Um, you have to something you can't see with the cancer was your final or vehicle, a party, a celebration. You might be invited to a party. Three's a crowd. Let's just clarify that. Um, before we do the partner want to tell you and what don't you see coming. Why is the chariot for Pisces here and the three of cups? Generous giving. So if you were dealing with someone who was taking from you Pisces and taking advantage of your kindness and here's that chariot again oh and the hangman pisces cancer very very it look at this the hangman which is this is the first time i uh seen this rewarded sacrifice tested dedication so that's cancer and pisces on top of the pisces um rewarded sacrifice so you're sacrificing yourself for someone you were the giver here generous giving Unintuitive comparison with that Queen of Cups reverse. This is all Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, I was clarifying the Chariot and the Three of Cups. And the Chariot and the Hangman is here again. So that is very odd to have two major arcanas clarifying the same message. And it's generous giving. So someone took from you. And I guess Pisces is not with it. Okay. You take from me, there's some consequences and repercussions. Don't, don't take, what is that shit? I'm going to make that the title. Don't bite the hand that feeds you. And that's what someone did, Pisces. And maybe this is what this revenge is and this anger and this anguish is. It's like, you want to take from me after everything I've done? How dare you? How dare you? You'll be like... The Kardashians. I'm going to put that clip in there. Um, what I'm talking about is that that's your your energy. I'm going to see if I, I can still monetize if I put that clip with Kim Kardashian when she was arguing with her sister. <laughs> anyway, what is the final advice here? So towards the end, you have a Pisces Cancer, um, Pisces Cancer Scorpio. Towards the end, now this could definitely be someone from the past and just to name everybody before we turn these cards over. Um, you have uh, Major Arcana, Virgo, Pisces Cancer, obviously, Gemini is here, Capricorn. That's Virgo again. Sagittarius. Pisces. 
Pisces again. And you know who you're dealing with. Capricorn twice. third party <laughs> what <laughs> okay and you had the three of cups right here this might be you Pisces putting someone in, in the uh, third party so not ready moving slow was reversed so now someone is ready it could also be an earth sign Taurus Capricorn Virgos just jumped out <laughs> All right, so who else we got? What else? What other messages? I love tarot. Should we just take one chaser? I don't want to chase anymore. What? Well, if you're if you're a feminine energy, I think we should we supposed to be chased. You know, a lot of people are not doing it anymore though. And it says a new card. I need more time to think. Space. So we got some new cards. Chase a space. Destiny. I'm struggling to find the right path. I told you Pisces. This could be some of us needing that vacation. Now if I did offend my Pisces. I'm, I'm sure Pisces don't get offended though. Um, let me just switch the story around. I like to save that to the last because Pisces, normally we don't seek revenge. We're not revengeful type of people. Um, someone could be wanting revenge on you. Maybe you put them in a third party and they're scheming up a plan. Okay. And you might just be moving on. Mm-hmm. You're turning your back. You're no longer waiting. You moving forward, Pisces. And if that's not what you're doing, you should be doing that. Alright. Also, the car cancer. You're going to be rewarded for the sacrifice that you've done. Again, you got destiny. I'm struggling to find the right path. Space. I need more time to think. Chase. I don't want to chase anymore. So that might be you saying you're tired of chasing these people. Let them chase you for once. Right? All right, so let's see what the partner want to tell you and um, what don't you see coming. Namaste. See Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I also will clarify this reading and I will post the 12 signs today. I will make it very short. So let's see. Link in the description box below. Pisces partner want to tell Pisces. What was that? Flipper. That was the seven of wands. Someone doesn't want to be defensive. Pisces partner want to tell Pisces. And the soulmate came out. <laughs> so you have a new beginning. Uh, a celebration as well, Pisces. F from someone. Pisces just got the um, ace of pentacles as well so you might have a um, a soulmate here Pisces which we already said traveling this person could be in a distance but um, and then here's the lovers at the bottom and the nine of pentacles so this person don't want to be single um, Pisces but I'm trying to figure out if I should take it or just reshuffle. What should what do Pisces partner want to talk? All right, let's just say someone wants to say they love you, but I want to reshuffle. I have good karma here as well. What do the partner want to tell Pisces? Okay, the Knight of Wands. I knew I should just cap it out. I seen the Knight of Wands too. What do the partner want to tell Pisces? The temperance, having patience. We're just going to make this very short. I know you guys are like, what? <laughs> well, we're going to clarify. 
Let's get one more for Pisces partner one to tell us. Alright. Traveling, walking away. And good karma again came right back out. What's on the bottom? Cancer, the devil, judgment, the world. Then you have good karma, and then you have the judgment reversed. So this is rebirth and also traveling. So someone wants to perhaps even start all over or you have a new beginning, Pisces, with a new partner. We're going to do, um, next is going to be um, what, okay, my phone. Okay, hold on, Pisces. Um, the four of coins holding on tight. So someone is holding on tight spirit. Let's clarify the three of cups. We're gonna have to get that phone in a minute. Um, why is the three of cups here for Pisces? Diminished returns. This is the partner now. Hmm. So someone and I and actually and this is the seven of coins and this could have been reversed so your partner may need to borrow money they don't want to, or a friend they might ask for some money to get the turkey um let me see ace of pentacles or pay their bill it was reversed excessive expectations three of cups reverse so now you got the three of cups twice so someone is a little greedy, honey. I always get this with Pisces partner wanna tell us some greedy ass mother lovers here. And you got the lovers reverse, haunted choice with the lover. And the choice should be easy if you're greedy, Pisces. Let them go, honey. I see the lovers, the thrives. Let me see. This is what the partner want to tell you. So maybe they had a greedy person when they when they left you. They left the connection. Rewarded sacrifice. Pisces had this lifting anguish and healing a loss. So your partner is going through some pain here. Here's the high priestess and the hierophant when I uh, cut the deck. So a spiritual. You guys are spiritual. You guys are mirroring each other. Have a lot of spiritual energy. Oh shoot. The phone is making my cards. Here's the High Priestess, the Hierophant again, and the Queen of Cups right in the middle of this. I can't, what the cards fell apart, and what else we got? The Nine of Coins, a Page of Swords, someone's stalking you. The Queen of Wands came out. Do we have any more cards that flew out? Um, Pisces. This is what the partner wanted to tell you. Someone could be... And then here's the Ten of Coins. Again, money. Someone is all about the Benjamins. This could also be reparations that we're waiting for. Manifesting a reward. Okay, let's see. Why is the Knight of Wands here reversed? For the partner want to tell Pisces. The sun and then the ace of cups and the ace of coins reversed. Missed opportunity, emotional readiness. So now someone is emotionally ready, missed opportunity with you. All right, unbroiled joy, unbridled joy. All right. That's the sun. That's Aries Leo Sag. I can't get the phone now. So, I think I'll have to wait. Let's see, Sagittarius. Why is this here? Healing. So, someone could be needing healing. That's twice here. Emperor, strong leader. Aries. Cherished memories. Someone is thinking about you. Shadow illusions. The moon. Someone is thinking about you. Why is the six of swords here for 
came right back out. I'm just too good with my shit. You got the devil, queen of coins, the tower, and the three of swords. Wow. Your partner got the, and they got the chariot reverse, the empress reverse, and the hermit. Woo. Baby. Three major arcanas back to back. The devil, three of swords, the chariot, empress, and the hermit. five major arcanas and it's all negative so i don't know someone like i said that addiction that we got in the devil could be um someone's addicted that could be your partner bananas here six 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 of cups six of six of swords traveling um someone could just be sitting outside of your job if they know where you work at And, um, or someone could be stealing pictures online and kind of, you know, taking the pictures and doing what they want with them. Or it's just stalking your social media. Why is the rebirth and death here? Someone is crazy, Pisces. Let's see. Four swords. Earned rest. Um, that's a Scorpio as well as, um... A crazy but Gemini. Four sewers, temperance, and the sun. Someone needs to sleep. The partner want to tell you. Um, they want to rebirth, but you're not sure about this. Well, this is a... They ghosted. They left for a while. And now they're reminiscing. Something like that. Cherished memories. All right, so let me see. You also, yeah, you got the Eight of Cups. It's like someone walks away. That is the part I want to tell you. So, and you got the Six of Cups. That means the person is reminiscing about this walk away. Mm -hmm. They took some time to think about the shit that they've done. All right. Let me see. Haunted choice. Yeah, someone made a bad choice in love. The lovers here. They thought they could find and could not find unfound focus look at that right in my words unfulfilled achievements yeah you didn't achieve nothing silent intuition didn't listen to the intuition was listening to the friends and foes all right they listened to the naysayers and made a bad choice in love and now they want to come will karma come right back to you pisces because they know that you are nurturer and you're forgiving you have a forgiving heart so pisces it, listen, <laughs> they made their bed, let them lay in it now. All right, so sorry, Pisces. What else do we have with the partner want to tell Pisces? Any messages here? Let's see, any messages? Six. Mm-hmm. Or oh, they are missing this about you. They could, like I said, someone could be taking a photo and let me just i just missed two 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 it was two 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 um let me see pisces partner want to tell us mm -mm. movement traveling that's that cancer it could just be someone coming asking you to pull up or they want to pull up what else for pisces uh, earth sign taurus capricorn virgo could be any sign at this point and illusion someone is not who they say they are and this is a twin flame also be capricorn and um comfort but i do see new love coming towards you pisces so this past person could keep on moving honey let's see what we got for the future partner want to tell pisces i mean what is the message for this um, the world travel. Yeah, so someone could be in a distance and you got judgment karma. Good karma. So this person could be in a distance. You guys might have a good sexual relationship or do. Okay, but I also see some other Pisces might have dealt with a partner that thought the grass was greener and maybe the wig came off or the makeup came off or when they was with the person this is not who they say they were all right and now this person is thinking about you pisces 
let's see what else we can grab for this message just before we do the future partner and what Pisces don't see coming. Any more messages? This is a new card, finally, right, Pisces? It says, unexpected outcome. Things didn't go the way I planned. Of course they didn't. This is, like, sometimes these cards be telling the truth. Like, you be like, wait a minute, what? This is exactly what the storyline is. So someone was thinking the grass was greener and the sex would be better with the other partner or they could find a better suitor. And now they see themselves up at night haunted, haunted by the choice, the bad damn choices that they made. Let's get one more. That was that was crazy. <laughs> Let's get one more for this reading. It says disagreements. I wish I under I wish you understood how I feel. Understood how I feel. So that's the past tense. All right. So you guys have many disagreements, and maybe they thought you know. Let me find out. Let me see whatever. Um. Because she looks very bougie. Unexpected outcome. Things didn't go the way I planned. So this looks like she's shocked. She got the cross on her neck. Ne the necklace. It doesn't look pleasing. Um, and with everything surrounding the card. It just seems like this is what the partner want to tell you. Um, so they plan to kind of find someone better. The grass wasn't greener. And now they're sitting here reminiscing. Not that we care about this, but this is what the partner want to tell you. Pisces. So let's get into like the new partner. And what don't you see coming? So, namaste. Alright, Pisces. I don't know what happened. But I'm hoping that the last couple of readings, when it goes dead like that I can't it, re, it don't record the last reading so I just want to go over everything for <laughs> what do, what don't you see coming so someone could be you have escaping so you could have ran away or your partner walked away eight of cups um reciprocity and overwhelmed so someone wants equal give and take in this connection you could be dealing with the soul tie someone is daydreaming about you you're daydreaming about them space i need more time to think your future outcome is the high priestess to the chariot cancer pisces cancer this person could be a pisces cancer or your remnant or someone from the past is thinking about you but you're moving on you also have Major Arcana Virgo Capricorn. This is taking a break, a break, and also toxic energy. Uh, Pisces. So what you don't see coming to me, I feel like someone is obsessing, and someone's gonna fight for this connection. And if it's not a partner, this is definitely work. You're thinking about moving, traveling. Um, if the job is not making you happy, making you happy, you're gonna go somewhere else. All right. So we have work, career as well overthinking you have the lovers euphoric choice as well as the career so if it's not a love connection it's definitely um work and you're either going to fight for this position this right or this relationship where someone is fighting for you so if that's what you don't see coming i see i see uh confidence all right i see love and i think the person if you're looking for a new partner this person is definitely going to give you this reciprocity that uh this other person didn't give you because the other person could have gave you an empty hand had their hand out trying to take from you and didn't give back to the connection regardless if it's tangible or spiritual or emotional you were given everything all right let's get some more since the camera died for what pisces don't see coming let's pull some more uh, the page of wands is reversed. It's like being uninspired. Uninspired. It's also the passion card. Pisces got the page of wands. You have the lovers again twice. Euphoric choice. So you might have a choice when it comes to love. Or a couple of lovers. Or some lovers have a choice between you. And here's the chariot reverse cancer. And here's the queen of cups. And the king of coins. 
So you might have a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio who's who has a choice to make. And you have the Eight of Cups and a Hierophant, Taurus, uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio again. Alright, so that's what you don't see coming. You have a choice or they have a choice in love. Let's get some more from what Pisces don't see coming. That was the Lovers. The Page of Swords. Someone is still searching you up, you know, but this is the end. The Death card. Someone might be wanting a second chance after rejecting your cup. And then, boom, here you are with the Two of Cups. You're already falling in love. That's what you don't see coming. You, you feel like, uh, Pisces, you can't get past the past. The past is haunting you. And you feel like you don't want to move on because you don't want to leave something behind and regret that. And you're afraid to move on, but it's time to move on. Pack the bags and go. Some of us already moved on with these cups. You have a soulmate, Pisces. The lovers twice. This is what you don't see coming. You have a deep connection with someone, Pisces, and go for it. The lovers, that's your reading, Pisces. And I'm going to wish you the best, and namaste. Click on the link below for the other signs. Namaste.